Hey, what's up, y'all? It's your boy, Iceman and Bob. I'm going to give you all a quick guide for your Samsung S95B on how to do the Max Lux One service menu mod. For those of you that are on firmware version 1430, when you activate game mode HDR, you have HGIG on, you will find that the image is darker than you were previously used to if you have previously owned this TV on a earlier version of the firmwares. So I'm going to show you all how to restore that brightness back. This is courtesy of Evil Boris from AVS Forums. And I will also show you some video comparison footage of before you do this service menu mod and then afterwards okay so what i want to tell you is first you're going to need a samsung remote it has to be an older remote uh, depending on the region that you live in it may have came with your s95b but you either want that or the smart things app if you have a samsung phone if you do have a samsung phone something that i want to mention to you you go into the settings here and just make sure that your TV is on Wi-Fi. For most of you, you will be on Wi-Fi. Uh, some of you are on LAN. I generally am on an Ethernet connection, but for the sake of this video, I'm on Wi-Fi. All right. So either way, whether you are doing this in the app or you are going to use the remote, it really doesn't matter what screen you're on. What you want to actually do is if you're going to use the remote or the app, you're going to hit mute and then 119 and then OK. Once you do that, you're going to see the service menu pop up that you see on the screen. However, we need to take things one step further. So after you hit mute 119 and OK or enter, then you are going to type in or press one, two, three, four. OK. Once you do that, it's going to bring up a different menu. OK, so now at this point, you can come down here and go to where it says SVC. OK, hit enter. We're going to come down here to option underscore HDMI. OK, go into there. And then what you're going to do is move over to the right one and come down one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. OK, this is where you will see Max Lux one. Now, it will be default set on 154. And what we're going to do is hit enter here and then we're going to back it down to 138. OK, for those of you that are wondering why 138. This is where, and of course you see the screen. <laughs> Let me try to show you this in real time. You might actually be able to catch a glimpse of the brightness shift. Okay, so this is where it previously was. Let's do this one more time. Let's go back down to 138. And you see that the screen did get brighter. This is all you have to do. You don't even have to press enter or any buttons after this. The only thing you want to do is hit the power button to let this change take effect. OK, so we're going to hit the power button. And then you can essentially turn this back on. The reason why you want to set max Lux one at 138 is because that's where it's going to measure properly with the EOTF curve and give you that brightness that you want. If you try to do any other numbers, it's essentially going to screw things up to make a long story short. I really don't want to get into that. I just want to tell you that's the reason why 138 is the number you need to settle on. OK, now we're back in here. OK, the changes took effect. Obviously, you let your TV boot back up and you're ready to go. You're all set. That's all to it. All right. We will pull up the menu in just a second here. Be mindful. I did just restart the TV. You see, we're here in game HDR. Um, just want to kind of run through the settings. Just bear with me. I did just restart the TV.
Okay, so we're on 1430 as far as the firmware goes, as I mentioned. And now when you do a service menu adjustment, sometimes your TV is going to take a second to boot up. All right. Even though it turns back on. So we'll come over here and you can see game HDR is on HGIG is on. It's active. And that's all you have to do. So enjoy the footage. And I really hope this helps you. Basen, at Nes Hawk. Are you ready to give up who you once thought you were? I am. Ready to sacrifice everything you held close. I am. Are you ready to leave your life behind and walk the path of shadows? I am. <laughs>
gloom. Its arrival brought chaos. But we found a way to control it. We choose the path. We face the danger. We control the chaos. To reconnect our broken world. We've all walked many paths. Sharpened many blades. Played a few tricks. Crushed a few skulls. <laughs> but now, we fight as one. We are Wayfinders. What I started, death's design will be complete. Discover Catherine's secret. Find out what it is that makes him invincible so we can strip him of his advantage. is a frightening man, but you have something he doesn't. Allies worth having. Together, we will strike down the Absolute. Wow! I'm sitting so high, but I'll never rise. 
Embrace the darkness, and so lies our only hope. 